So I'm still at the uh, apartment complex here. Just trying to hear if anybody else is trapped, if anybody else needs help. It's crazy. It's so still and quiet. Really freaky. You can see there, the power's still on. So there's still electricity in these areas. You can really smell gasoline on the water too. You can see it floating around. Hello? See there's still power on, it's crazy. The bridge is, uh, I mean, we're really close to where the creek is now. The bridge is just on the other side of it. You can actually see some of the, the rescue personnel over there. I've gone just about around the whole complex here. I don't see there's anybody else except the two people that want to want to wait it out. You can see I'm, I'm moving with the current right now, so you can see the water flow flowing out is really slowly. Crazy. You can smell. Uh, like I said you can smell the gas. You can smell the gas in the water. You can kind of see it. A lot of cars out here. Kind of flooded. About every uh, about every hour, there's another fan going off train. I think we've already had about nine inches today. Had 19 inches last night. Total for the storm where we live right now, it's probably, uh, say, probably close to 30 inches for the whole storm. We're still expecting rain tonight and tomorrow. So, yeah, we may be getting some of that uh, 40 inches of rainfall, which is just nuts. Turn this around. So this is what uh, Friendswood's looking like. I heard Houston's really bad in areas too. Leak City, Clear Lake. This is uh, widespread damage. And I mean, this is a really high population area too. It's gonna be a lot of people that need help. Right now I'm just going around in the kayak to some of these kind of back places that are up against the creek and just seeing if there's anybody that needs help. I pulled a lady out of her house a minute ago. She was really sweet. Hello! That's weird, you can see like people's doors are open. Look at this garage, like everything's like flooded, like everything. This is crazy. Like there's a pickup truck in the garage. just so crazy look gas bottles floating around you can smell gasoline on the water my wife told me if I found a uh, baby squirrel or a uh, like a chipmunk or something like that I gotta rescue it for her see the powers off at these meters and we're back on at some of the other meters Look at that, that's the top of an SUV. Back hatch is open. You gotta check up these trees. Cats, in the trees. Look at that. Yeah, so somebody asked a while ago, like, um, gators, yeah, there's gators here. Snakes, I saw a huge water moccasin earlier. Look at this, top of a car, completely flooded out. Oh wow, look at this. See that? That's the top of a car too. Jeez, that is crazy. It's freaky. That is freaky. Kind of 
very strange feeling just being out here. I'm like, it seems like I'm the only person that's out here right now. Hello? Holy shoot. What the hell is that? Look on the roof. Uh, what is that? Some kind of big ass bird. Oh, it's, um, what is that? It's a, is that a peacock? What is it? Is it a falcon or something? I can't tell. You guys know what kind of bird that is. Only thing I know is it's a big ass bird. It's chilling on the top of this uh, apartment building over here. Let's see if I can zoom back out. It's just hanging out. I guess it's about the best place for it to hang out. Crazy. Yeah, so there's going to be a lot of people in Friendswood, Leak City, Clear Lake, Webster, Houston. I mean, I'm mainly out here in the suburbs on the south side of Houston. It's where we live, about 20 miles south of downtown. <clears throat> a lot of uh, a lot of this going on. I should really upgrade to a little boat that's got a motor on it. Once again, all these buildings are underwater. I want to cross over to uh, Cowards Creek and head up the creek the other way into some of the other residential areas. So I'll come, uh, I'll get live, live again when that happens and show you guys. I think this complex is cleared out now. Guys, do me a favor too, like share this video so that people know that there's a lot of people here that need help. I mean, they're gonna need supplies, blankets, food, things like that. So please share this, spread the word, let them know that, look, this flooding is the real deal down here. A lot of people need help. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the camera away so I can uh, paddle a little faster. Oh, look at this. That car's electrical system is cutting out freaking out all right I'll uh, I'll be back live later if you guys want to check back I don't know how you turn on the alerts for like a uh, live but anyway I'll be uh, out here in the flood zone probably another uh, two to three hours uh, once again if you know somebody in friends with that needs help please let me know um, and maybe you can comment on here maybe my wife Kristen keep an eye on it so I'm gonna go down towards the creek and see what we can find there see you guys